luck. I kill her soft. Go. This can't be. We're going to... This isn't possible. I didn't think we would win. But of course we would. We're strong after all. Just when we had gotten everyone excited. It ends like this at the last moment. This will be a freaking mess to clean up. The time has come. I've been waiting for this moment. Huh? This world and its CPUs can no longer fight against these negative emotions. Wait! That's... You can't! Anything but that! Now, let us begin the reorganization of this world. This... game industry. The world has been rewritten. Now, General Afimojas, what do you desire of this newly reorganized world? Well, I will require as much as I can possess. Money, is it? It seems the greedy exist in any era. Are you planning on starting a war? War? Conflict that relies solely on arms is conflict of the days of old. In this century, information wars reign supreme. Not only this, but information exists as both weapons and wealth simultaneously. This is the very reason my secret association, Atmax, exists. I see. You're more of an intellectual than your appearance suggests. But it wouldn't be good of you to forget our promise, now would it? Do not fear. I have not forgotten. I have already prepared the acquisition at your request. My subordinate is on the move. Ah, yes. Your subordinate. Steamax, was it? When will you introduce me? He obeys me and follows only my commands. I have no intention of him making your acquaintance. How cold. And here I've lent you the few friends I have. But it's fine. Just obtain the item. I've waited so many years. Do not make me wait any longer. Huh? Guys, where are we? I'm pretty sure we were somewhere else. Wait, where's everyone else? Am I alone? Hey, Noir! Blonde! Bert! No one's around. Noir and Nepgear and the others are gone. What in the heck happened? If I recall, we lost to some weirdos called Gold Third. Then we suddenly were engulfed in light. And the woman who showed up in the arena at the end, wasn't that the older me? I swear she was yelling something important. She looked kind of desperate, too. This sound. Could it be? Neptune? You're safe! Yep, I'm still kicking. What about you, Noir? I have no idea. But I think I'm somewhere in Last Station. I believe I'm somewhere in Lean Box as well. Same here. I'm pretty sure I'm looking at Louise. Bert! Blon! I'm so glad you two are open. Likewise, Neptune. I remember making a few mistakes in battle and losing to Gold Third. So stupid. But when I came to, I was just here. Looks like everyone's in a similar situation. I feel there's something going on that's way bigger than we could have imagined. Are you talking about those towers? Exactly. Those massive towers definitely weren't there before. Towers? 
Wait! There they are! Towers! What are those giant things? And there are four of them. Well, my guess is that those towers might have had something to do with this. I can't really think of a sane reason why we'd all end up where we are right now. It would be best to return to our nations. Thankfully, we can still communicate, so we should gather your younger sisters. Right. We're clueless. They'll be a big help. All right. Then once we reach our respective basilicoms, we will make contact again. Got it. Now that I know everyone's safe, I guess I'll try walking towards Planetune. I have absolutely no idea where I am, though, so I... Oh, well. I get the feeling that some people are over that way. Oh. And so, the four CPU sought out their own nations, anxiously pondering the four strange towers now looming over game industry. This was the beginning of their story. Ooh, which story should I start? Neptune, Noir, Black, Bird. Oh. Let's start with Neptune, because that's the main character. to start my story! This game's protagonist has to be me, after all. Woo! I'm finally here! Seriously, though, this tower is super gilded. And now that I'm getting a good look at it from down here... I know! If it's this huge... If I just shimmy up this thing, I'm sure I'll know where I am. All right! Just a sec. It won't all... Ooh, I get it. Guess not. If I transformed, I could... I'm not giving up just because I can't transform. If I can't climb from the inside, then I just got... So, this is the Golden Summit. As a tower enthusiast, I'd love to... It seems worth trying to climb it, though. Maybe... Ah! Hmm? From I said move! W why is that kid falling from the sky? Kid? I can say the same thing about you! The name's Aya. Wait! It's Iffy! <laughs> to think I'd reunite with you like this, Iffy! It reminds me of the first time we met. If I remember, I accidentally slipped off the top floor of the ch Um, who the heck are you? And how do you know my nickname? Oh, come on. Don't you think that's pretty cold, even coming from you, Iffy? I didn't mean to disappear from the arena so suddenly, so I don't think it's right of you to get angry over it. What in the world are you saying? Did you hit your head when you fell? Do you have a concussion right now? Because if you do, I'm gonna need to call an ambulance to take you to a hospital. Not cool, Iffy. Even I could get angry if you keep poking fun at me like that. <sighs> this girl's no good. Maybe it's because she hit her head so hard, but everything she's saying is complete garbage. Huh? Just a minute. I'm not angry, and I'm not joking at all. Jeez, you're a rude person. That sounded like a serious reaction. Sounds like? <laughs> it is a serious reaction, weirdo. But that's a relief. You can actually hold a normal conversation. For some reason, I don't see any injuries on you either. So I'll be going. I'm in the middle of a job right now. Oh, I'm since you're here, I'd like to ask you for help with my investigation. Have you seen anyone suspicious around here? A suspicious person? Yeah, like a really suspicious old lady. Nope, I haven't seen anything. Crap! It probably means it was a hoax. Something wrong with this lady? If you're after her, Iffy, then she must have done something bad. I can't give you all the details, but she's the perpetrator of several thefts. I came here after looking into a few eyewitness testimonies, but I guess they were cold leads. I better head back to the Basilicom and investigate some more before I make a move. The Basilicom? Yeah, but... well, 
It'd be a problem to leave a kid in a place like this. Yeah, I'll tag along. You should be fine here. By the way, there's no way you're not injured after that fall. So you... You heading to the Basilicum, Iffy? That's what I was thinking, but there's a change of plans. I'm gonna gather some more info here before heading out. Oh, cool. So do you think I could? Nope. Don't need your help. Aww. This is my job. I can't let a kid like you just shadow me into some dangerous situations. I'm sure you'd just get in the way anyhow. <laughs> You're so stingy. Yeah, yeah, sure thing. Just get yourself to the hospital, all right? Okay. Now then, putting aside the fact that if he doesn't know who I am, I made it to Planetune, so I should figure out what the heck's going on around here. I swear on my pride as a fish, I will protect these girls.
swear on my pride as a fish. I will put... This is Lady Bisha's Holy Basilica. I will not allow you to make a mockery of it, even if you are but a child. I will not go easy on you. Just hang on a second, will ya? Good grief, what a noisy child. Huh? Wait, excuse me, but what's going on here? Oh, Lady Eastwar, this child is causing a... Child? Why, Neptune? Isti? Isti, you haven't forgotten me? How could I possibly forget you? Oh, goodness. I never thought I would see you again. Oh, Isti, me too. Iffy. Lady Eastwar? Is this... Yes. She is a very old friend of mine. Understood. Come, Neptune. Let's not stand around here. So what in the haze... What's going on around here? To be honest, I am not completely sure. However, it is certain that the existence of CPUs has been erased from the collective memory of game industry's population. So, that's why everyone was acting like they just had met me. Wait, then how do you remember me, Isti? This is only a theory, but it may be because I was created artificially to record Planetune's history. I believe this phenomenon occurred because some unknown power somehow altered the entire history of game industry. That may be why the Gold Third is currently presiding over this world, and the CPUs are entirely non-existent. Oh. There are several distinct changes. The first is the appearance of monsters. They are ferocious, and have never actually been identified before. They're entirely new, and their numbers are increasing rapidly. There are also reports of a strange phenomenon where some monsters suddenly become violent. In the past, there were cases of monsters being polluted via the deity of sin's miasma, but this is a separate anomaly. Since they attack others indiscriminately, we are calling them delusionary monsters. They are currently under investigation. The second change here is that organizations are using their existence as an excuse to skirmish with other factions senselessly. It is not escalated to full-blown national war, but its scale is slowly increasing. The most serious threat, however, is the group said to be manipulating all of this from the shadows. You're talking about Affimax, right? How do you know that name? That information is being meticulously controlled. Oh, I just saw it on an Enchan thread. On the internet? 
Has the information leaked? Oh, don't be silly. It's N-Chan we're talking about here. So what's Affymax up to? When I asked on N-Chan, people said they didn't want to talk about it. They told me to stop fading and go back to Nepit. Ooh. Affymax. Reports have indicated that they steal business technology and information, sell it to others, and are the ones spreading the war. So it's kind of like those mastermind orgs in anime and games that start wars to make a profit by selling weapons and supplies. It is precisely that. Still, just because there are no CPUs, how did the world get so dangerous? Hey, that also means that all those people complaining about us being incompetent were totally wrong. Eat that! That may be so. Recalling those times now, I feel they were by far the most peaceful. By the way, where is the gold third member that's ruling over Planetune in my place? Well, I am not sure what caused this twist of fate, but she slacks off just as much as you do, and is out today as well. Why is it that those in charge of Planetune never like to work in the slightest? Oh, of course! If Bisha refuses to work, then I can simply have you take her place, Neptune. What? How'd you come to that conclusion? The world is in disorder because of these conflicts. This is the time you must fulfill your duties as a CPU. What? I will not hear any complaints. Planetune, no. The entirety of game industry is facing a crisis. Then can I go help out Iffy? Help IF? But she does not remember. Yeah, I know. I met her earlier. Is it not painful? Yeah, it is. But it can't be helped. Besides, she might remember me if I hang out with her enough, you know? From your story, Isti, it sounds like Iffy's taking on Affymax alone. And I don't think that's the safest thing for her to be doing. You are right. We have no idea what the outcome may be. So I will permit you to accompany her. Woohoo! However, you must not get in her way. Understood?